guys, what are we gonna do today? Do you have extra windows or glass pieces hanging out around the house? Well, today I took Icon Art stencils, screen stencils, and stenciled this image in, and I show you how I took several and pieced them together to make this large image, and then we painted the back so it gives you almost a watercolor look, and then we added IOD transfers. Let's get started. So since I'm gonna be piecing four pieces together, you need to make sure that your project is big enough. So I'm just lining it on here to show you that this is definitely gonna be big enough for what I'm doing. And start with my first piece. So you're gonna take the shiny side and that's down and you're gonna peel. And very carefully, I'm just gonna take a damp cloth, just a damp cloth and just lightly wet it. I don't want it drenched, but enough that when it gets wet, it's going to stick. When it does stick, it sticks. So you really need to make sure you have it where you want it. And you want to make sure there are no bubbles in it. I'm using a dark chalk paste for this project. And I'm just using this rubber tool, but you could use a credit card. I'm going to pull this one up. Just do a wash of some gold in here. I turned my window over and I'm painting the back side. Okay, so this is what it looks like in the front now and you can see the light colors back behind it. I think I'm going to add a couple transfers on here. So I hope you learned some fun new techniques. Um, I used the chalk paste to do the stencil. I watered down my paint on the back to give me more of a watercolor look on the front. And I used my IOD transfers to fill in some areas and give it some more dimension. And then I sealed it with just a generic sealer. But come up with your own masterpiece. Use bits of the ideas or all of it. I'd love to see what you do. And thanks for watching.